Hey Linux friends, welcome to the Linux Ninja, your one-stop shop for all your Linux related needs. Just call 1-800-RHCSA certification prep, it's only 99.99 a minute. But uh, this information is free, so no need to call. Just click, click and subscribe. This information is farmers market fresh because I just passed the certification 2025, here we come. Before I tell you what I would recommend that you read and how you study and how you prepare, I want to tell you a story. Back in 2007, I bought my first RHCSA book and I read the first two chapters and honestly, I thought I can never pass this certification. Why did I believe that I could not pass this exam? Well, if you're anything like me, I just suck at taking exams. I did not finish grade 10. I flunked out of school. So I had this idea in my head that I could not successfully complete anything academic at all. But amigos, I have the solution for us and it is to over prepare. And how did I over prepare? Well, I got a monthly O'Reilly subscription. It's 47 euros a month probably the same in dollars. And let's say you wanna to try to pass a certification by just reading one book, one book alone to rule them all. Well, I would recommend this book by Asghar Ghori. And why? Honestly, it's not dry. A lot of these books, they might feel dry, but this is somehow engaging. Each chapter ends with an exercise. You get four mock RHCSA exams at the end of the book. So I would definitely recommend this one if you just wanna read one book. Uh, let's look at another book by Michael Yang. It's actually, I bought my first RHCSA book by Michael Yang in 2007. Uh, this one is good. Uh, so, uh, Oscar Gori, I read the whole thing through. This book by Michael Yang, I probably finished 65, 70% of it. And then by Sander von Vogt, I uh, probably finished like 30% of his book and it's not because it's bad at all. It's just because I watched this lecture by him and I can't remember how many hours it, it is. Let's take a look. As you can see, it's 14 plus hours of video instruction. So I just felt while I was reading the book, there was a lot of overlap between the two. So I just chose the video instruction instead of the book because I was already reading two other books. So that's how I learned the best is kind of like mix, mixing methods, uh, video and text. So that works for me. From Sander von Vogt, I also recommend the RHCSA 8 practice test because of course, there's a lot of knowledge there that's still valid for the current exam. So you get two practice exams there, good stuff, recommend it. Uh, and then the RHCSA exam labs. So it's four hours of video training plus the 14 that you already got. And so it's get the final prep before the real exam. So recommend it. This is all you need to prepare for the exam. But if you're somebody like me, like we were just talking about, you need to over prepare. And let's look at another playlist that I created on O'Reilly. And this is where the true magical value of the O'Reilly kingdom kicks in. On the exam, you have containers, SE Linux, security, scripting, users, blah, so much stuff. You need to over prepare by doing a deep dive on each of those subjects. And so let's look at some of the stuff that I have on my playlist right here. So Linux Security Basics and Beyond, LPIC. I looked at some of the LPIC stuff, Linux Shell Scripting, Advanced, Basics, Linux Networking, uh, Command Line Skills, Getting Started with Containers, Mastering Linux Administration, um, I did not read any of these books through and through. Don't think that. I'm not a maniac, people. <laughs> I looked at specific chapters. I looked at answers uh, when I got stuck. And so uh, let's look at something like how Linux works. It's basic stuff. It's like mastering Linux security and hardening. Cool stuff. Mastering Linux command line. SC Linux. This, this is good stuff. Uh, system administration, SC Linux. Um, so mastering Linux shell scripting so much stuff. I watched a ton of Sander Van Vogt 
a live courses. So on O'Reilly, you can book a, a live course where he's just teaching you live. You can ask questions. You can ask the people that are attending questions. It's really fun. It's cool. Uh, Linux troubleshooting, mastering system D, so many courses that you can actually take. If you do a deep dive and you over prepare, I am 100% sure that you will get this certification. But the certification alone is not the point. It's to become a well-rounded Linux administrator that can handle anything that happens on the job. If you have any questions, please comment down below and I will do the best that I can to answer. I hope this has been informational, even motivational, if you will, if you're interested in the RHCSA certification. And until next time, peace out.